Merry Christmas, everybody. I'm meteorologist Jordan Steele. We are expected to see a great day today weather wise. We have a few leftover showers early on. The big story is this next system is going to be moving down into California. So what that means is we're going to have two days of dry ish weather, which will be pretty nice. Now this morning we have a little bit of drizzle, the fog and low clouds, but all of this should be mixing out throughout the day today. So I'm expecting to see some sunshine, filtered sunshine, but it'll be sunshine. And then as we head into tomorrow, we still have a break. OK, so I'm thinking fog, sun will be the pattern for your Thursday and then we'll get into some increasing clouds and eventually seeing some more showers work their way back in as we head into tomorrow evening. That'll be pushing across the region, allowing cooler weather to continue to filter through snow for the mountains, which is good. Snow elevation is going to be about 2000 feet. Now uh, for Christmas forecast, you've got temperatures in the 40s. Uh, just so everybody knows this is where I'm going to park our high today. Again, we're looking pretty good. And then if you just want to get weather on the go, you could of course download that King 5 app. It'll get you all that weather information you need to know straight to your phone. Now here's the interesting thing as we look at your seven day forecast. I told you how today was going to be pretty good other than a few showers this morning, but as we head into your um, your Thursday, I do have uh, another dry day before that system squeaks through on Friday and into portions of Saturday. Saturday night and into Sunday, that's when we have another storm that'll move through. Good snow for the mountains, showers for our home game for the Seahawks. I'll have temperatures that'll be trending in the 40s. And as we move on to end the year out, we've got a new system arriving on Tuesday.